fuck? This is like stream rape right here. It's like, what's that? You said no? All, right, All I like, heard is yes. I'm All like, I heard is yes. So what? I don't know. Maybe a little bit pressure. Oh, boom. We got a first hit coming up. <laughs> Charger gets shut down. Jockey lands for a few ticks. Gets player spitter shut down. I'll end the first hit for 22 damage. Welcome and to RBT round five. Simmy's team versus nonstop. Uh, what is Simmy's team's name called? What? Roadrunners. Roadrunners versus nonstop. All right, let's do the roster rundown real quick for nonstop. Go ahead. On oh, nonstop side, we have Miro, Yozy, or Hosey, or Josie, or whatever the fuck. And Joe Tex, Hosey. and Mr. Uh, Thug Life. And uh, on not nonstop, Roadrunner. That's their name, Roadrunner. We have Ryu, Simi, Sarah, and Moscow. And uh, everybody thank Flo for bringing this live to everybody, because uh, apparently it wasn't tested otherwise. And second At this point, he's just streaming it now to spite Simi. <laughs> I just want to streamcast something, that's all I want to do. Not much, not much changing since that first attack. Another n eight or nine points going on the board. It looks like the survivors are just gonna move into the hotel. There's gonna be an attack. It's not gonna be on the alarm car because the first alarm, first car is alarmed. First alarm car is alarmed. First alarm car is alarmed. Alarm, alarm, alarm. <laughs> so we're going for the second alarm car, but it's not alarmed. Yeah, exactly. He's going for the non-alarmed alarm Who car. Are you? going for the second non-alarm car. All right. Charging charge a nice charge. Front, yeah. Able to get that slam, making a total 25 damage. It looks like the tank is going to be up at 76 percent. So we're not seeing a lot of damage go out to the survivors right now, but I'm pretty sure, or at least I'm hoping that the uh, the infected team is going to do some work with this tank. He puts himself out of position though. Whoa! First tank is up for Team Roadrunners in hands of China, aka Sarah, less than three wizzes. In love with Easy, I think. Reloading! Yeah, China's a good shit, man. I, like I just, I, I don't know, I was trying to read the, uh, the name, the, you know, people are always adding weird shit to their names. I know, I was just saying, you know, China's a good shit. No, shut the fuck up, Zen, nobody likes you. <laughs> China also, uh, played under Team ITG in a last tournament, another Swiss tournament. Little round fact for you. The pings are excellent here. For everybody involved. Well, I mean, I have great ping, but... Boom goes out on Rochelle when she's trying to get some extra chip on the tank and the horde's gonna move in on the survivors. Chances are that horde's not gonna touch it though. And this tank is gonna move in for a better rock spot. So here we go. The tank is right there, right? This, this attack is gonna go in and if the survivors know what they're doing, they're gonna push this tank right after it's down. Oh, is the tank gonna go for cars? I believe he is. This is such a hit or miss proposition. Like, all you're really doing is... Well, I guess now keeping the survivors from rushing. If I know China and his tanks, we're gonna be in for quite the show right now. This 3K show? 4K. Is it a strip show? Is it like pants off, dance off? Tank pushing the car in. Almost hitting Rochelle. Boom goes in on Ellis. Car flipping around on the near the tree. One punch whiff. Two punch whiff. Charger intercepts the whiff punch. Beautiful car <laughs> placement. Excuse the me. Car goes down. I think he'll be able to get the kill. Mm, Ooh, no. Car not cooperating. Oh. Yeah. There's two things working against him there. One, you have to crouch. Two, you have to crouch. So really, it's one thing. Gravity is a pretty difficult opponent when that car is flopping like that. <laughs> flopping around like a fish. Reloading! Reloading! Exactly. 
That was not exactly what Team Roadrunners, right? Roadrunners? I'm never going to get it right. Yep, that's Team correct. Road. That's not exactly what Team Roadrunners wanted out of that tank. I mean, one in cap is it's not bad. It could have been worse. A no-hitter would have been way worse. But uh, he just didn't have a lot of health for that committee. He took so much chip. I agree completely with that. But for a high-level team like Nonstop, I think that's about the best that they can hope for. High level? These guys glitch witches. Hey man, I'm trying to give this team credibility. <laughs> Just talking shit. I know. They, I'm sorry, I, I forgot. Uh, quotations. They glitch witches. Quote. Quote. There you go. That's a lot better. But the, uh, the survivors are going to move up for this last hit from the infected side. Hunter, Smoker, Charger, and probably a Boomer? I don't know. No, it's a spitter. Hunter Charger, Smoker, Spitter. Smoker gets a quick pull on Coach as he comes up the top, but it gets cleared immediately. Hunter pouncing around on the left. Coach is going to be the bait here with no health bonus, and the Hunter goes down on him real quick. Charger misses, gets immediately cleared. Smoker is in the back, but I don't know what the fuck he's planning on doing other than pulling Nick for... for maybe 5 damage? 3 damage? And this health bonus is fucking huge, Flo. Flo! Flo, this health bonus is huge! Flo! It is, it's pretty big. Flo! And Zen, shut the fuck up. Huh? Exactly. And only about a 500 point difference, still anyone's game going into round two of Dark Carnival. Yeah, I think if nothing else, uh, non-stop showing that they have uh, some survivor chops that they like to show Simi's team. Because... I mean, that's a huge, I mean, getting, you get wiped right outside the safe room compared to making it with two sol, or, well, two and a, two and a quarter solids. That's pretty, I can't tell if they outplayed them on Survivor or just a shitty infected round came out from uh, Roadrunners. I wish I was here for the first round, but unfortunately, Simi's a faggot. <laughs> so I can't tell you which one it is. Yeah, a little technical difficulty with Simi and uh, admins and sir, please, but I'm glad we all got this sorted out and now we're here for the stream. Yeah, we had to go tell on them. We had to get the Rails Barlow involved. Speaking of Rails Barlow, that Misha Collins guy that, that Rails has in his avatar, I'm just gonna say this. Come on, guys, give me a yay or nay. Very sexy man, yay or nay. Come on, Zen. You know what I'm talking about. You've seen the show, Supernatural. I got you. In, I got you into it. As long as he's using the Castiel voice, I'll go ahead and go with Nay. I mean, a, yay, yay. With Yay. yay. Yeah. I mean, well, I guess yeah. He does talk kind of weird when he's not doing the Castiel thing. He's no Dean, but you know. oh, Dean. Now I wonder if Rails, you know, obsession with him is homo or no homo. I don't know. Feel free to tell me in chat, Rails. Yeah, right. <laughs> Can we get shout outs? Homo or no homo? <laughs> There's gonna be three people watching this up until the chosen stream. Yeah, for anybody who wants to watch a good stream, chosen one is playing a game in a minute. Attack goes out on the survivors, but nothing really lands except for the charger and the hunter. A couple slams from the charger, a little bit of damage from the hunter. A better hit than... It's a better hit than most hits. About 70 damage on a first hit, it's not bad at all. You know what that is? That's why you don't hide in the safe room. Reloading. I agree. You, you gotta you gotta commit out of the safe room with your survivors, you can't be a bitch about it. Alright, I got and a he... shout out coming out from uh, Big C, and he says both Simi and Colors are faggots. It's true. And, uh, and <laughs> did anybody true. notice Antax went to Jared's on that witch? Was I the only one who saw it? We got it. Oh, shit. Hmm? He went to Jared's on that witch. Nah, you know what? I was like, just thinking of myself. You know, about the whole Misha Collins thing. I don't like a, you know, big fan of Supernatural. I have one kind of beef with that show, and that's like, they changed the meaning of the word ganked. Reloading. They changed the meaning of a lot of words. Yeah, like I, you know how many times I've seen Dean call somebody a mook, and I like look over my shoulder waiting for somebody to get mad. Well, the other thing, like ganked, is like it's a gangster term, man. 
Like, that means you get robbed, not killed. Shooting me. Same. A little nice well, play by Rochelle, know. hiding behind a wall when Boomer tried to arc, Boomer expecting her to run forward. A little nice play right there. Very sneaky. And it looks like they're gonna get rid of the hunter, but it looks like they're gonna have exactly what they want for this. Are they gonna get rid of the hunter? They should. It looks like the hunter just delaying them by his screams. His right? wails. The, the hunter is just channeling their inner pub star. They're like all wanting to skeet him really bad. Pretty much. There he goes. Oh! Ooh, the charger's getting leveled right before oh, he can charge tank. him. The separation. Smoker body blocking. Did you see those survivors push through that spit, trying to make sure their guy wasn't all alone? Was Ooh. that a, was that a good was that a good move or a bad move? I think it was a good move. Not a saying trapped. With nowhere to run. With a propane tank on his side. He's already down to 500 health. Ooh. And dead. Damn. I think that tank could have went a little bit better. Don't you agree? I uh, I thought it was gonna go really good, but I think part of the problem was is that he put, he had his big backup was those two dumpsters, and he hit both of them past the survivors, so the survivors had nothing to worry about pushing him. That is true, but he also locked Nick inside the truck with that dumpster, preventing him from pushing out until the tank changes the uh, focus off him. Then Nick could f freely waltz out that uh, truck. The survivors are in a bad spot right now, though. Uh, except that charger missed. Oh yeah, the survivors are in a pretty bad spot right now. Rochelle and Ellis both in cap. Now Ellis just got back up. Coach is losing all of his permanent health to the jockey. If you could get a hunter on uh, John Z over there, it might be the end of him. I gotta disagree with and his choice that of strategy. Is exactly what happens immediately right after I said that would happen. Wow. I gotta, I gotta disagree. The separating thing wasn't a good idea. I would have got Ellis up with the two survivors and then went down and got Rochelle. I agree. That's the... As it stands now, they lost two players. Well, whoop, they're actually going to save Rochelle? Well, I guess I'll just have to eat my hat. Do it right now on stream. Alright. I want to hear the shoes. I don't uh, actually have a hat. Oh, uh, you lied. If I had a hat, I would eat it. Alright, I'll buy you a hat and I'll send it to you. And then you got right, stream. Somebody, somebody get me a cowboy hat so I can consume it. Please. Double Boom goes out in the front, Coach and uh, Rochelle. Non-stop is going to be trying desperately to make it up to the top and, and get a little bit more distance. But... I don't know, I'm, I'm wondering if Simi's team can... Roadrunners, I'm just going to call them Simi's team. I can't... They don't even have a name as far as I'm concerned. But... Um, I'm, I'm not sure if Simi's team is going to be able to survive that tank. And the Charger standing near his fallen brethren, Charger Ragdoll. He's gonna get some uh, revenge for that fellow charger that was slain. The bleed is real. Survivor is just sitting there bleeding at the bottom of the ladder. Oh, charger gets baited. That was a pretty nice bait. I actually thought he landed on him. Ellis getting the M2 wall, speed climbing up that ladder. Rochelle with her one health is. Oh, shit. Charger despawned. Will he be able to get it off the pickup? Nope, doesn't look like he's going for it. He wouldn't have gotten anything anyway by himself. He would have got mowed the fuck down with his half health. That is probably true. <laughs> no, actually it's true. I really need some juice. I think I'm gonna go get some juice. Zen, don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. No, no, Smoke gets that. Nick. Wow, Rochelle gets a clear eventually. Reloading! I'm gonna reload. And we see Infected going in staggeredly. Maybe now they'll realize that they should probably sync up and get a complete full on hit. Jockey gets shot down by one guy. Then Charger gets shot down. Spitter is the last one standing. Spitter spit delays the pills. Good play, in my opinion. Now they gotta wait for that pill that they so, co so covetly desired. They're dying last, they believe we should see a 3 cap now. They're coming! 
They still alive. I gotta get juice. I expect a wipe between then. <laughs> okay. Non stop going ham on their survivor round again. Saying fuck it, we don't need Josie to win. <laughs> Shout out to Easy for being a little bitch and calling me on uh, Steam while I'm trying to stream this game. Yeah, you fucking bitch. And survivors somehow three only able to make it to the safe room front. It they might no oh, charger just two. killed Celeste. <laughs> but then he missed a static Rochelle. I got a shout out from Wrathlord1996. I wonder how old he is. <laughs> <laughs> Raffle, what kind of a shit stream is this? La 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 la. Are you sure that's not Wrathchild? Yeah, it says Wrathlord1996. Uh, I was gonna say, because it's Then we got another shout from Xbox Above one. and Beyond called the 90s called and they want their phone back. <laughs> that is a uh, Steam call, if you didn't know. It's not actually my phone. <laughs> but that's a good yeah, one. Yeah, well, I think what Flo meant to say is shut up, faggot. <laughs> if anybody thought your jokes were funny, you were funny, you'd be fucking casting. Huh? Yeah, think about it. Hey, be nice to the viewers. There's hey, nothing he's just better one to do. viewer. <laughs> we might need these. Charger, oh. Hunter, Jockey. Not nearly as successful as the attack that they uh, launched. About a 50 point difference in damage, but still uh, a uh, meager, decent hit. That that charger like smacked into the wall. Ugh. We have this witch right here, which I kind of missed the first time around, but got it this time. Four Roadrunners. They're gonna have their hit up. Very nice crowd by Moscow. He didn't even crouch. There was not a single fucking crouch. I guess that's what you call them roadrunners. Too oh, fast. Shit. Charger Hunter Spitter Smoker up for this hit just outside the entrance, but it looks like the infected are setting up inside the warehouse. Hunter is pre spawned, everything else is waiting. And the baiting is real. I'm gonna crack some heads with this. Reloading. Nick pushing in. Smoker. Hunter. Uh, I gotta hand it to them to Nonsa. They're making some ballsy hits. They're just not pulling them off. Yeah, I mean, I think part of the part of the reason that didn't work is the smoker didn't grab Nick when he came into that room. Like, why else would you would you spawn yourself right there if you weren't planning on grabbing the survivors that came in the doorway? Where the fuck is Nonstop from anyway? That's a good question. I'm Does anybody know? Can we get it? Can we get somebody in the in the audience who knows what the fuck they're talking about? Tell us where they're from. Mongolia, Uganda, where the fuck? Somalia? Any of the above? None of the above? I'm gonna guess Euro. I'm reloading. Hey, I'm reloading. I don't know. Uganda would be a pretty good place to be like. Ah, oh, we're from Uganda. That that would be a pretty good guess. I, I would say. Wow, and, people. Uh, in, according to colors, people in Uganda sound like Indians. <laughs> oh man, I can only do so many impressions. What do people in Uganda sound like, Zen? Why don't you tell me, you racist prick? <laughs> I know they don't sound like no Indians. Oh, how do you know that? You been to Uganda, motherfucker? Passed you there before. And people say we're unprofessional. It is a shithole. And yeah. Ryuzaki, aka Vayne, goes into the front, gets oh my smoked God, forward smoke while Tank in. is coming in, and Jockey rockets in. AI, I guess, running back up. Oh, no, the it's an actual are person. Real. Ooh, Alice getting flanked across. Now they actually get to run back. Tank doing the opposite of what he should have done and pushing them away from him instead of locking uh -oh. him in there. What happened is Ellis got a really nice juke right off the bat from that tank, and then the tank punched him the rest of the way down the hallway. So it was like sort of like a ping ping pong ball bouncing like he, left and right. He, he gave that to them. He was just like, "Yeah, fuck it. You guys can take the field." <laughs> 
I'm going to take 2k chip. You guys can have the field. I'm going to lose to my first pass. Also, I can play with these dumpsters. Who are Antax? You better get at least one in cap with these. No, you're not going to get it. Crouch. Hit it when you're crouching. Colors, uh, players cannot hear you. Yeah, but if they could, they'd be like doing some shit right for once. Boom goes in on uh, Ellis real quick, and this tank is fully committed. Smoke goes in on Ellis, the boom guy. He could actually escape if he decided to. Maybe when he had 3k he could have, but... Mm. No support. YOLO tank right here. I guess... I guess non-stop is just gone YOLO. We've seen the first couple of attacks, they were pretty YOLO. And then the tank decided instead of pinning Ellis in the, in, without his team, he was going to push him with his team. And So, I mean, maybe non-stop is trying to help Simi's team out. Grabbing a machine gun. Everybody grab a so pretty much the big hope here is on this ladder choke. Nonstop really needs to pull something out of their fucking assholes. Something a little bit more traditional, I think. Charger! This was Team Roadrunner's big chance to make it with some good health bonus. Moscow rocking a good 82 HP. Feeling pretty healthy right there. Ooh, pre, oh. pre fire on the propane tank actually worked against Rochelle. Yeah. Simi is in capped on the ledge and gonna die to commons if her team doesn't button down and do something. That common horde is very big. Mm, and the and goes reset. out on coach. Moscow loses his health. Big sacrifice, too little late oh my god that one health save it's from 82 to 1 how unfortunate I think if they made that sacrificial health bonus decision earlier they may, may have actually been able to save to me I don't know personally I'll take uh, I'll take 50 HP off of my permanent bonus to save a dude as opposed to running away from the spit I agree that's what that's what I think should have been hap should have happened as opposed if somebody, to waiting. One or two people or all of them should have just pushed up the ladder and buttoned down, but Coach gets pulled in the back after a triple boom goes out and a spitter sitting on top of him. Moscow's gonna take his first end cap. And we're gonna see if uh, Roadrunners can uh, make it all the way. Or most of the way at least. What the fuck was that jockey doing? I don't know. It looked like he wanted to go to China, but then he nice. redirected and couldn't climb up. Reloaded. Poor decision by Reloaded. a jockey, though. Ooh, both survivors walking into that boomer. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be interesting. If the survivors can button down and make it, they can get a few more points. I mean, they're only behind by seven, eight hundred points right now. <laughs> <laughs> Double cap lands for a second. Ellis and Nick, the only health bonus. Moscow is about to be black and white if he doesn't get some pills into his system. And they're gonna... Oh, there's one set of pills! Oh, God, the Charger. I thought the Charger landed. As did I. I think he just got the punch, though. He went for the punch charge. With uh, China rocking that... Quite healthy 62 HP. Looks pretty good for uh, Team Roadrunners right now, but we'll see with one more hit incoming. They might be able to make it, or will they not be able to make it? I don't know, man. Uh, one more, one more boom goes out, and uh, booming one guy just makes it really easy during an event like this. You want to get a multi boom if anything. All the horde seems to be funneling from their back. Zero horde in front. Yeah, it looks like they might actually. Well, no. Look, and look at nonstop's got this last hit. All they need to do is take the take fucking Nick out. Ellis in the front. He's dancing with the charger. Double cap in the back. That's not good. And uh, oh, health point is still still there. Nope. Nope. 
20, is, 10, no, 5, is down. Oh, and that will be it for Team Road Runners. Close, but no cigar. And uh, I don't know if anybody noticed one of the members of Nonstop complaining about how he got a boomer and a spitter a bunch of times in a row. Oh, shit. Yeah, I saw. He said he got it four times in a row, apparently. Well, that's just the game telling you you can't play the regular infected, bro. It's like, bro, we'd give you a charger if we thought you could land the charge, but no, here, have a spitter. Honestly, my opinion on that is, if you f if you don't land a boom, and you will most likely get another boomer because it's like a game feels bad for you or something. It's like, all right, you didn't get it enough of this play, so you play it again. That's just my crazy I mean, theory. I've I seen it. Jacob, like Jacob told me that there's a bug with the director where you can get the same infected multiple times. But I think part of it is just when he dies, you know what I mean? If he dies and the, the spawn the spawn rotation's already decided that the cappers are up, he's going to get one of the support. That's just that how is, it goes. That is true. But what I noticed Hello. was, like, when I get a charger and, like, I charge and I miss everybody, I'll get a charger again because AI director's like, oh, I feel bad for you. I'll give you a charger again. See if you can do something better with it. Here, have another shot at it. Yeah, exactly. And I'm just like, thanks, AI director. I don't know, man. I mean, the boomer was doing work with the boomer. I just don't understand the complaint. It's like, oh, I was boomer four times in a row. Well, shit, what do you want? And vintage AI director, tank 19%, early tank, giving the affected team a chance to make a comeback. Vintage AI director right here. Uh, oh, 19%. So this is going to be a either they're going to take it in the safe room or they're going to take it outside the safe room. And it really depends on whether or not they have cojones. Not back to Denver. Oh, this Wrath Lord kid seems to be obsessed with Dildo. I'm reading the chat. It's like, FLO! You and Dildo look the same! LOL! LOL! Color sounds a little short midget like Dildo, Raffle! Wow. I think that's, uh, Susky, aka Chrome Mike, aka Sancho, aka Susky. Scrub. Scrub AKA, International. AKA e that's his name. AKA I Wrath. I, I'm just gonna like, every time I quote his typing, I'm gonna yell because he's doing it in all caps. Yeah, well. And when people type in all caps, I, I assume they're like, I like you guys! I you like guys are turtles! Awesome. I <laughs> like turtles! Yeah, <laughs> caps lock is cruise control for cool, alright? Besides, you know, if anybody knows about high level play, high, high level play it's Chrome Mike, alright? Come yep. on. And let's Team be, let's Road be. Runners bringing in the sub. The sub is here. The Chrome Mike that, sadly, I was on his team, Chrome. Send digital trying to troll, Raffle. <laughs> if I'm trying to troll, what the fuck are you doing, sir? Alright. Oh, man. Oh look, it's the scum sucker supreme, Big C, coming to play. Fucking scumbag, Big C. Oh, oh piece wow. Of shit. I can tell you guys are friends. I heard he was on. I heard he was on that Stick Up Kids team. Heard Zen Digital is captain of that team. Zen Digital's a faggot. Only a 500 point difference. Still anyone's game. I can't believe you're actually reading the chat, Zen. What is that, just in case somebody has a shout out? No, just... I'm just bored. Bored. <laughs> and the only one who's typing in there is some Aspie named Wrathlord. Well... He's got nothing better to say. Yeah, we know, Dill. Going live, third oh, map. Bills. Team nonstop going first. We have a uh, boomer, smoker, charger, and jockey for the first hits. Dildo just sent me the chat log. Apparently, he's watching too. Well, then who is it, Dill? It's most he, likely. What do you Mike. mean he wouldn't talk shit about you? That kid would talk shit about his own mother if he thought somebody would let him play with them. 
<laughs> After this hit, I'll say something. Get nice double boom and a double two cap charge jockey. My god, this hit. What a brutal double. hit, eh? I've never seen it yeah. hit that brutal. That was almost that was almost like that hit on Dark Carnival 2. It feels like you wanna watch where you shoot him? It, it kinda feels... makes you wonder why are they winning. Yeah, right? Tank is up in hands of Simi from Team Roadrunners. How about we take this into uh, Team Roadrunners War Room? Well, I don't know what to tell you, Dill. Obviously, whoever it is is some scrub ass. Like, oh, wait. the only other person I know who we has like, wrath in their name is that Xbox kid. We can't take it into a War Room because Team Roadrunners is. You finished my sentence, colors. Um, we can't. We don't have any war rooms because this match was not supposed to happen, or the match was supposed we to happen. We could but... war room, but it involves me mad mini. All right. That would be pretty rude. Just drop flow into their fucking game. Their war room. <laughs> yeah, actually, I could. I could just link the channels. But I'm not gonna do oh, it. Oh, mad Men. Yeah, we Nick's trying to get some early chip on this tank, but the tank is moving in. He's at 4k. Looking for a corner on Ellis in the back. Getting one punch. Support a little bit late. Nope. Oh, double cap. Nope. Momentary double cap. Triple boom. But I did, nothing. And the tank. I think that tank could have done a little bit better if his support was a little bit earlier. He was about 1500 when his uh, support rolled in. I'm not sure I would have chosen those people to corner either. I like it, it just felt like he went out of his way to get Ellis. I always pick the guy who looks like he's dumb enough to corner himself. Hmm. Reloading. Well, that ends the tank for Roadrunners. <laughs> and yeah. let's see if he can make up some damage with these following hits. If only non-stop would fucking glitch a witch right now. Reloaded. Reloaded. And that is never gonna get old. Got to reload. Hey, remember I was telling you about the kids who scream when they cry, Zen? Hmm? Do you remember I was telling trouble. you about them? The yeah. kids, they scream, they don't cry, they're just like, What <laughs> is happening right now? Down the hall. Next hit is up with Charger Smoke for Jockey and Spitter. Will they hit in the bottom or will they hit in the top? They hit at the bottom, but it looks like Nonstop knew exactly what was happening. Sent the non health bonus in. I mean, they, they did send the non health bonus in until Rochelle decided she wanted to run through the spit. Pretty decent hit. One of the better hits we've seen from Team Roadrunners. Charger getting a double charge in spit. We're seeing like one or two good hits per round, but it's just not enough. Now appreciate my beautiful skies, viewers. Brought to you by some add-on called, uh, I forgot what it's called, but it makes the skies beautiful. Yeah, part of the, part of, this is the issue that they're having right now, is that Nonstop has this, you know, 500 point lead from map one, so it really doesn't matter how much health bonus they tick off. If Roadrun or if uh, Nonstop can make it far enough into the map, then they can just keep maintaining that that point disparity all the way to map five. I mean, Roadrunners really needs a wipe here. They really need to. This coaster's brutal if you can if you can actually do it right. So. Everybody just follow the joke. Smoke goes out on Nick on the top. Oh, Ellis is fucking is a, dead. Is Beautiful. Dead. It's about fucking time. And Antex looks like he's uh, on the top. Oh no. No, he's, he's on, the on the bottom. He just. Yeah, that's it. That's uh. That will be a wipe for you, ladies and gentlemen. The wipe that the wipe that we requested has come out. Thank you, Roadrunners, for wiping them. The Left 4 Dead 2 gods are smiling upon Team Roadrunners. Hib has spoken. Hib has granted their wish. Thank you, O thy Hib.
So now, I think Simi's team needs to make it to the end. Not even necessarily with health bonuses. They could just make it to the end and they can make up some points. It's an 800 point game. So. They can put themselves within a couple right hundred up, points. Flo. Oops. I thought I did. You should be the first one to ready up at all times. Yo, I spammed my ready button like eight times. GG keyboard. You should have spammed it nine times. Simi's team pushing out. Looks like the special infected are waiting in approximately the same spot as before. Looks like Boomer Smoker Charger Jockey. Reloading. And I'm doing that without my spec HUD. That's just so so elite. Smoker lands for <laughs> for nothing. For nothing, nothing point, but the charger lands. Point zero 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 one seconds. Almost yeah. immediately cleared. That was uh, that was 18 points going out from non-stop onto Simi's team. Pretty well played. I mean, we're not seeing the same kind of attacks come out from non-stop. It's just that non-stop has just got. I I, don't, I can't tell if they got. I think they have better survivor play. What you want to say is you can't tell if they progressively got worse or if uh, Team Roadrunners progressively got better. No, no, I think, like, non-stop, I think, just has shitty infected. And Simi's team has shitty survivor. I think this, this is like the battle of the ages right now. I'm serious. I'm not even trolling. I mean, that's what it looks like to me is that non-stop just has, sh you know, like... Yep. <laughs> look, look at a solo boomer going in, getting popped immediately by Rochelle. I agree. Poor infected Simi's play. infected were doing... They were doing like 50-60 damage hits where you shouldn't get 50-60 damage, so they must be doing something right. But they can't survive to save their lives. And I think that that might have been a pun. <laughs> They're joking there somewhere. <laughs> right? There's a joke in there somewhere. Thug Life is uh, the tank for non-stop. Looks and, like he's uh, uh, letting it go AI. No, I'm just kidding. He's gonna roll <laughs> in right now. <laughs> he's gonna be pro and let it go AI. Real pros let it go AI. Smoker's looking boomer, for the pole front. And they're running to that corner where there's nothing. Nice play right in that eight. corner. He's buying time. Ooh, good oh, good curve rock. just went AI for that rock. What? I've never seen anything like this. What? The fuck? What? Oh, the triple boom goes out, and he's chasing the jockey guy. Tank the jockey guy. Another punch on the guy who's no longer jockey. Wow. Okay. What a clusterfuck. It's like I said, like eight seconds ago. One of them can play survivor, the other one can play infected. If they made a team together, they'd be unstoppable. All right. <laughs> Thanks. Reloading. Man, this shit hurts. I mean, I got a you got to question the decision to throw that last rock when you have no rage. Hmm. It landed, but it made his tank go AI, and he got an immediate spawn after that. And we have a charge landing. Smoker misses. Hunter lands. Smoker lands, and he gets cleared. That'll be the end of if the. You, if you ask me, I think that uh, they had the boomer before that tank went AI, right? So the boomer wasn't the 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 tank, right? Reloading. I'm not sure who the tank I think they became. I think they had the boomer beforehand. Gotta reload. And, and if no, they did, then... I think the I'm... boomer was the tank. Really? I yeah. thought they had the boomer. You said that they had a boomer. They cycled the boomer for a 3-cap, and then the tank committed, and then the 3-cap went in, and then the boomer, who was the AI tank, went in. Paddle bat here. I guess it's a catch-22, because if they had the boomer with a tank that wasn't AI, they could have got the wipe, but... If they didn't have the boomer to begin with, then... He probably wouldn't have got the wipe. Well, I mean, either way, they didn't get the fucking wipe because he sent the tank AI. Yeah, I think that he should have just. I think he should have just ran in there. <laughs> Coach getting pulled, but he's stuck on the Swan. Swan neck OP. Please nerf Jacob. Thank you. Swan OP. Charger gets a a charge on. Uh, looks like Nick in the front, taking away all of his health bonus or most of it anyway. Good to go. That'll keep me tight. And uh, I don't know if anybody remembers, but I think uh, Nonstop was in a much better position at this point last round. They had three survivors with solid. Each one was like 40 HP or something like that. 40, 50. And that all that still couldn't help them from getting wiped at the closer. <laughs> yeah, that double charge was uh, pretty brutal. Double boom goes out in the back on uh, Ellis and Rochelle. 
the rest of the infected are gonna save. And by the rest of the infected, I mean this. No, the smoker is. What the fuck is he? The chip smoker is now saving. Did he really stay there for an extra chip? He's got 204 now. You know what, man? That's like a big C strat. <laughs> 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 and uh, now they got the uh, the jockey charger, the spitter, and the chip smoker. And they're hoping to make something happen. Big C and his strategic fail has become famous. A melee skeet onto the jockey. Will he get the common shoot the dog? And he stays on. Mm. So close. Yep, that was that's got to be a little disappointing for non-stop because this is if Simi's team can can button down and at least get the distance, then we're looking at a much closer game than we were, you know, five minutes ago. I gotta give it to Big C, able to get land a melee skeet under such high pressure on that jockey. Big C's a piece of shit. The witch right there, and so is a smoker, and a hunter. Oh, the fucking witch takes out the guy with the most HP. And she finally gets killed. That smoker drops down. Good play that smoker. Very sneaky smoker. Yes, next level strats. This is that chip smoker we were talking about from before, too. Ha! It's quite ironic. At least he didn't let him get to 20 points. Yep, Semi's team is just moseying ahead. I mean, like I said, I've said it a couple times, even if they lose all their bonus, they're still gonna make up that distance, close the gap. And it's pretty insulting to make this. This coaster is pretty brutal. It's got there's a lot of choke points. Reloading. Boomer coming in from the bottom and getting a boom on coach before the charger takes him off completely. But then the boomer knocks him off. <laughs> so he just recharges. Hello, <laughs> Rochelle going down off with the jockey. Coach is dead. Ellis turns off the uh, the event. Rochelle is down, and it's looking like Nick and Ellis are just going to retreat to the safe room. Two of them are dead, but at least the, the alarm nope. is off. Ellis makes it. Nick is dead. So uh, three of them die, but at least that alarm is off. See, they totally used the big C strat. Like, just run to the safe room. Fuck the rest of us. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's a that's big C for you. But on the on the bright side, I mean, it's like now it's a 300 point game, give or take. It's like 200, 290 points. Ooh, and the jockey trying to do a safe from spawn. Now is that legal in this tournament? Well, I mean, it would have been illegal if he had made it, I imagine, but he didn't. What would have happened if he did? Minus. As well, long as he been, didn't attack I, or do any damage inside of the safe room, I imagine it's okay. Yeah, if he just went in there to jockey walk, I think that would have been okay. But yeah, that would have been acceptable in my book. You gotta, you gotta question, you gotta question the thought process though. Nonstop has but already he, gotten a zero point round for glitching a witch. Yeah, I mean, you also gotta take this into account. Like, if the jockey's in there, the round's not ending, so they're still bleeding out, and it could cost you know a fraction of a of a fucking point and shit. Yeah, yeah. would have taken it. Would have taken down that 14 HP. Yeah, you totally gotta just to like defuse that. You gotta minus all of their score for that round for nonstop, just to make it even. Right. It's like that's the only reason anybody's gonna beat nonstop this tournament is by DQing their fucking rounds. <laughs> <laughs> they are like English to jockey. England to win. They are their own worst enemy. Who needs to fuck nonstop when they can fuck themselves? <laughs> <laughs> right. It's like nonstop's like, oh man, they might dispute us. We should just fucking, we should just sack ourselves. They're so good. They need to put themselves as at a disadvantage. That's good. They are. I guess they're just looking for the challenge. Too easy. Where's the challenge? Dude, do you even challenge? <laughs> now we got nonstop on round on map four of Dark Carnival coming out of the safe room. We're gonna see a little bit of baiting and maybe another one of those ridiculous opening hits. Smoker tries to smoke Nick. Charger tries to charge a wall. Succeeds. Smoker tries to smoke Nick again. Succeeds for half a second. Not, not that impressive. Like, 
There was a few misfires there in that attack. Well, they did get a lot more damage than they should have, you know. I don't know why they pushed out like that. Because... I mean, after after the infected had already wasted their attack. Maybe they just want to get to the safe room. Maybe they want to see this Envy ver or this uh, Wolfpack versus uh, Long Shlong Dudes match tonight like everybody maybe else. Maybe Big Sea Strats are contagious. Oh shit. Hey Cole, there's no cheap promoting over here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> maybe they're channeling their inner intel. Yeah. For everybody who doesn't know, LSD versus Wolfpack is uh, tonight at like 10.30 or 10 o'clock or some shit. Reloading. Check it out on watchleftfordead.com. We, we get to see Dildo versus the Black Salami. We see the infected set up in the front here. We got a charger and a jockey. Or no, a charger and a fucking smoker and a spitter. Very nice. Momentary yeah, it's like a momentary charge on coach, a little very, bit of spit damage. Wow, very nice short smoke charge spit, followed by a instant smoke and dead spit. Reloading here! Reloading! 82% tank, huh? Reloading! 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 Really? What? Nobody knows how to crown a witch anymore. What do you want them to do? Like, what, did they crouch again? <laughs> yes! You wanna do a jumping 360? No, you don't even have to do a 360, but if you're crouching, then what the hell are you- what's the point? Why don't you just fucking put the shotgun up your ass and pull the trigger? Alright. Dildo said something to you. And yeah, I'm just gonna lots, say that. He says yeah. lots of things to me, but he I- said, He says- It's a Polyon, you idiot. Whatever. Colors. Wolfpack versus Polyon. Are you kidding? Colors? I'm so sorry that I I can't fucking. Oh, I thought it was gonna be a good game. It's a Polyon? Never mind. Nobody nobody fucking watched that game. Hey. Last time I seen those scrubs play, they fucking bitched out and started acting like scrubs on the map three. So. Look at the survivors holding a pressure on his tank. His tank is just hiding from them. He's like, I don't want to take that much shit. Which is probably the smart thing to do, but survivors punking him out. But his tank. Oh. Getting a rock! Oh. Oh, that's fucking hilarious. I've never seen a gun room tank played as a rock tank before. Have I you, guess Zen? Not, I guess non stop is just not. Is they're not prepared to give them the opportunity to, uh. Hey, look at this second wall chip and shit. Like, just wait in the wait in the room for the tank to commit. What is so hard about it? It's like their name says non stop. Right? They just can't do it, they can't stop. It's like, they're having a jitter, he's just waiting for the tank. Tank is committing with the Charger Hunter Jockey. He misses his first punch on Nick, but the Jockey lands on Nick. Nick is still Jockey. He is missing his punches all over the place, finally corners a Nick when he's fucking super slow. Gets a punch on Rochelle, misses a punch on Rochelle, we got a one punch tank. Now, can't stay down here. We got yeah, zombies to kill and shit. We might need we've been not been seeing some. We've not been seeing any impressive tank play coming out. There was like that one rock, that 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 one rock. But so anyway, yeah. Apparently, it's a Polyon versus Wolfpack, and I didn't know because I was really excited to see somebody other than a Polyon play. But fuck me, I guess. Was it a Polyon D team that beat? The number one team. Oh, they were they were the team to beat until they lost. Now they're just another team. You're only the team to beat until somebody fucking beats you. <laughs> so Listen, I was not finished before you rudely interrupted me. I, um, I got a, I got a <laughs> shout out from Dina from Dynasty to Dildo, and he says it's 15 legal in Texas. Oh, that's rude. Kiss Me would be so disappointed right now. It's too bad it's not Kiss Me stream and he can't say shit about it. No, it was from it was from to Dildo. I kiss no, me. I know, but I'm just saying. Uh oh. Like. Let's go, let's go. Right now he'd be like, "Oh, can you not say that stuff on my stream? This is serious business." <laughs> <laughs> what is he, Richard Nixon? <laughs> Dude, Kiss Me seriously when he streams, he thinks he's fucking CNN. <laughs> 
When it's more like the Onion News Network. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it is Shot the Onion I News love Network. Kiss me, I kid. Yeah. Shots no, fired. He's not, he's not kidding, but he does love you. Wait, maybe he's kidding about loving you. Maybe he's kidding about loving you, but not kidding about that. Or maybe he's not kidding about this. Enough to breathe. <laughs> what the they fuck? They say that in Texas? Rochelle getting caught in a buttload of all over the south. Primarily oh, in parts of Appalachia. Reloading here. It looks like non-stop is going to make it into the safe room with a little bit of bonus. Charger Phil is If they can... If they can make it into the safe room at all. Charger. Charger Phil. Okay, shout out from Dildo to Dina. Nope, 15 is not legal, but Sideways Box thinks it is. I'm pretty sure that uh, there's a law in uh, in Texas, the Romeo and Juliet law. Am I am I wrong? What? There's a law in Texas that says that if you're like in high school and you're dating a girl who's underage, but you're both legal of uh, legal age to date, but then you grow up and like graduate from high school, that you can still technically date her since you had a pre-existing romantic relationship before you became an adult. Ah. Uh. It's like being grandfathered into the relationship. That's what I'm saying. No, no, the laws in most states is four years from the age of the minor. Because I know plenty of dudes like... Yeah, stop, from stop back with in the, the day. plenty of dude shit, Zen, alright? We all know you did time for fucking molesting a minor, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, have you ever heard the old Hispanic adage like, Hey man, I didn't know she was 13. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh god. As a Hispanic, I am insulted, but I cannot help but laugh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Well, Zen, you're a dickhead. Zen's half, Zen's half Mexican, though, so... Yeah, so it's all good. I'm taking it back. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Zen is half Mexican, half Vietnamese, and half stupid. Wait. Full hmm. stupid. <laughs> Survivors have left the safe room. Nick getting smoked and punched to shit. We see more damage coming out from non-stop. It looks like they finally decided that they were gonna, I don't know, attack. We still have a relatively close game. If Simi's team can button down and get, I don't know. Again, I'm gonna say if they make it to the safe room, but they're gonna be down another couple hundred points because of the bonus. All they gotta do is buckle down and fly right, right? Colors? I don't know. All they gotta do is not be fucking bad and do something. Like this helicopter just crashed into the grass, but okay. Well, as long as the viewers know the status of the helicopter, that's okay. Yeah, right. I don't listen. Hey, bro, I, quick I want you to just no, take the, no, zoom out, zoom out, get away from the action with the survivors and shit. Let's stop pretending that's what this game is about. Go find the helicopter. No, it crashed already, but I'll, I'll look for it. It's, not there. <laughs> it's not there anymore. <laughs> Flo, did, Flo cannot find the helicopter, guys. Which so I'm sorry. By Moscow, assist by Big C. Reloading. I think that witch would have got him if he didn't get the that assist. The 19 point assist from Big C. That 19 points made all the difference, apparently, because they only did 980 damage to it. Well, yeah, it was that, 999 that, for the two of them, so what the fuck? Was that witch chipped, or...? She was winding up after he got the shotgun roof. on her chest. While crouching, it still failed. But if I had support, he would have got capped. And we have the tank up in the hands of Mero. Miro. What the, whatever, I don't know. Miro. And, uh... I will, you know what? <laughs> but, um... <laughs> Hopefully, I mean, hopefully they shut down this tank. Is hopefully they shut it down as as and more handily than nonstop shut down the uh, Roadrunners tank. Are you cheering they, on Timmy's team? I'm saying that right now, as it stands, it's map four, and they've been the fucking underdogs for the entire game. And it'd be nice to see them actually play like they want to win four hundred and fifty dollars, as opposed to playing like they just want to fucking. I don't know. It's like, hey guys, let's go for third place. Yeah. You know what I mean? Another shout out from Dina to Dildo. From a scale of one to him, how mad is Swift? Eleventeen. My guess. Sancho. Oh shit, that's pretty mad. Tank is committing right now. He's already down to 3k, but he spins around and gets a punch on Ellen. 
quick corner on Ellis. Semi is going down, but I don't know if this tank has enough health to capitalize. Especially considering everybody fucking punches or goes to punch his fucking infected kill take. Seems to have it was like the, he did do work, but it was like it was despite his team, not in, not it was in spite of his team. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because you look at that whole the whole play by play goes. The tank tried to corner Ellis, right? And the hunter almost landed on Ellis, ended up getting Nick. And then he tried to punch fucking what was it? He tried to punch uh, uh, Rochelle, and then one of the infected took Rochelle, or he was punching Nick, and, one, and then the jockey took Nick, and it was just like, seriously? Let me have something! Stop taking my shit! Take it! Yeah, that was pretty impressive considering how everybody was taking all these targets, he still managed to yeah. redirect. It was bad. It was bad coordination, but it was good tank play. Cause at least he had the uh, the gumption to fucking not punch his own teammates off by accident. Well, not only that, but you know, some some tanks will get flustered. You have to be able to to readjust and just go for somebody else. We have a hit going in. It looks like a momentary double cap lands. The big the big hey, number here bonus. is Moscow. Yeah, <laughs> Moscow bonus. just lost his bonus. Big C is the only one with bonus left, and you just know that's not gonna last. Shout out from Dildo to Dina again. On a scale of 1 to 10, Swib is a 45. Why don't you guys get a room? There's a thought. <laughs> Zen's only here for shout outs. I hear they're relatively inexpensive during the summer months, and they have free air conditioning. Jockey goes out in the front for half a second. We have a hunter setting up for not even a DP, just looking for damage right now, waiting for his team. They don't want Big C to make it in. That's the infected. They don't want Big C to make it in because this is going to close the gap. Of course, Big C jumps up on the on the uh, rooftop. Yeah, <laughs> and then he loses uh, and then he gets pounced. Nice M2, Big C. Way to go, shithead! And uh, I'm looking. It's looking like a wipe. Big C yes. puts himself in the most, oh, most difficult position See, to get that covered. That is the Big C we know and love. The big right? C That's the Big C. C. He just he like he was trying to be a douchebag. He's like, I'm just gonna hide up here. But it turns out that he can't play. And yeah, I called it the wipe. So, it's a 600 point game now, Four, 550 point game, pretty close, if the, uh, if, uh, Simi's team could get a fucking wipe with the tank, then. So, which game do we have on this tournament for the next stream? Uh, Anyways. Chosen's, Chosen's team versus whatever team he was playing was, was on, was on at 7. Oh, okay. Seven that Eastern? Was, yeah, so it's on like it started a half hour ago. Alright, so forget about that. I'm really bad at like team names, so I don't know what the fuck they're called. To all the viewers, just check out watchleftfordead.com to see all of the latest uh, okay. tournament games and also all of the competitive Left 4 Dead 2 streams. Yeah, all the professional Left 4 Dead 2 streams are going coming up later. This is uh... This this stream is just to troll Simi because he didn't want us to stream. Gee, thanks, colors. That's true. Not completely. Well, I mean, it's mostly true. About 45%. I have, I, look at if, look at this. If you had come to me and said, "Hey, Simi asked me to stream," I would have been like, "Yeah, I think I'm gonna go take a shit." But you came to me and said, "Yo, Simi doesn't want me to stream." Well, of course I want to stream now. That sounds like a witch. We got a hunter. Big C tank. Come on, guys, crown that witch like you have balls. There you go. Hey. See, Miro, you're the man. Just gonna say that. While being smoked. Under heavy so, pressure. We got a big C tank. We got some uh, some pressure coming in from non-stop. We got big C deciding, fuck it, I'm not gonna wait, I'm just gonna take some chip. What do you think? Wipe? I think wipe. Actually, no, I don't. They just sacked their boomer, so... 
they're gonna and go the for the smoker. This guy's rocked. Sm so funny in front of they, the tank. <laughs> if they commit, it's gonna be with a three cap, no boomer, which is gonna be oh shit. Misses. Tank goes in, misses the first punch, misses the second punch. I could call it GG right here. Misses. Oh no, he landed on Nick. Oh yeah. Ooh, playing it. Oh, land. Playing the back pretty good. He's, he had a, he didn't have a lot of health. He had two K. What? Oh double, what? double, double Is this multi. gonna happen? The fucking multi! Oh my fucking god, oh nonstop, god. you're so bad! What the fuck is wrong with you? They got too cocky! Jesus Christ! Go back to fucking Ukraine or wherever the fuck you're from with that fucking survivor play. That seriously was a wipe. That no, no no, I mean like it shouldn't have been anything. That tank got way too many punches. Well they got hella cocky. Lost every I guess health so. bonus they had. Only uh, sitting on uh, Thug Life's bonus. Well, we got non-stop playing like they're fucking Envy up by 6,000 points. Well, we had Coach... One other came out with them and they ended up getting split. So Tank just went after the inside guys. That, that bit of cockiness there fucking cost them dearly. Yeah. That was... It was looking. The tank had 2k health, and he got all those punches with 2k. And he got, he got like, three or four punches on two dudes with, like, 800, 400 points. Some shit like that. Like, no health. Oh, and my... I switched my music to a My Chemical Romance concert, so deal with it! Yeah. Oh man, Ellis just went down. Boom, followed by a charger, followed by a little bit of spit. He just fucking got wrecked. And these survivors do not have enough pills for the amount of fucking arrogance they've committed to this survivor round. They really are, they, were, they played it like they had way more of a lead than they did, but if they don't start tightening up their game, I mean, they're gonna, they're gonna leave it wide open for Roadrunners to take this game. As it stands now, I mean, Roadrunners just, they don't even have to fucking make it. If they were to wipe them right here, they wouldn't even have to, they would just have to make it most of the way. Gotta reload. Yeah, at this rate, I think we're gonna see a uh, bleed out Roadrunners tank. Mm hmm. Which means uh, everybody get their fucking Snuggies on and their pillow pets out. Because it's gonna be a while. Watch out! And if you don't have a pillow pet, peas. I was gonna say, if you don't have a pillow pet, get one. No. If you don't have a pillow pet, you're missing out. <laughs> it's a pillow pet! There's a tank in the hands of Big C. Oh shit. Ellis is black and white. Which means his pills his pills aren't going to anybody else. That's it. Those are his. So this tank okay, really why even to... bother rock throwing? I, I just commit. We can afford it. Uh well I mean I it's think, Big C. He's afraid he's, he's gonna, gonna miss more punches. Rock goes in on uh, Coach and in Cap's Coach because he wasn't paying attention. Rock goes in, misses Ellis. He's playing the bleed. He's counting on the survivors not pushing him, but Ellis is black and white. He ain't got nothing to lose. He's playing the tank the most intelligent way possible. Oh, there you go, Ellis. Nice. Getting a deagle scare on that rock. Seeing, we're seeing a whole lot of YOLO come out from non-stop. Oh, that rock clipping the ladder. Come on, come on. I want to see him kill the black and white guy with a rock. That's all I'm hoping for at this point. Nope, too short. Three survivors up right now. Thug Life, Miro, and Antax. Josie dead. Which seems to happen a lot, because I'm pretty sure Josie died in another another time. Hey, over here. Ellis has uh, cut her away from being dead. Rochelle's has cut her away from being in-cap for the first time, and the tank is committing. 
Now that he can't fuck it up anymore, he's committing. So what do you think, Color? We two? saw, I think, a terrible survivor round just came out from nonstop. I think this is a prime case of when keeping it real goes wrong. <laughs> When keeping it, I think, I think Team wrong. Nonstop had like a very intense nigga moment. Hey, or they like, which, like we said, Zen is a, a a mixed race. He doesn't he doesn't uh, the same rules don't apply to him. Yeah, you gotta understand like like if you live in the hood, no, you know what a nigga moment is. So may I say, colors is L two L tournament? What L two L tournament? Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> this was Zen was Zen was night. It was it was explaining what the hell just happened to nonstop. Yeah. But it's when you get you know nigga moments when you get too big for your britches, think you know shit, and you get fucking the ass for it. It doesn't sound pleasant at all. And nope. Team Roadrunner is playing it well, doing a remote draw count on that witch. Before they could get into the zone where they had to spawn a tank, so well, I think you're gonna see like a, it's gonna be drastic because nonstop played it so fast and loose, and the tank is up in the hands of Josie right now. But nonstop played it really fast and loose, and I think really stupid. And I think we're gonna see Roadrunners are gonna play it really try hard, and they're gonna try and button down and take this game. Well, when in doubt, try final map. Yeah, that's it. They've been playing possum this whole time. Yep. We're gonna see a whole new different team playing. Look at that slowdown! Yep. Jesus! The tank uh, wasn't even moving. Tank. That's two punches that the tank has landed. Three. We got a double cap out in the front. Coach is coach is completely cornered. And and poor that, Michelle. That may this be is, it. This is a wipe. This is all she wrote. He's got two. He's got two K health. This is it. It's a wipe. He doesn't need to oh, throw wait. A rock. Wait, he got cleared. Oh. Yeah. The uh, the hitman coming out from Big C. And we just saw nonstop just reverse the heat on their moment from earlier. Yeah. What we just wow. saw was what we just saw was nonstop saying, "Here, you can have the game," and then being like, "Nope." Starting See, from, uh, their aggressive play fucked them when they were playing survivors, but their aggressive play fucking won out as infected. Hey man, I think I think the uh, the hallmark of that game was the Big C Hitman on map five right there. Yep, we will be talking about that for ages. <laughs> right, I might just message Big C right now and be like, hey. nonstop winning round five of another really big summer tournament. Hosted by Rails Barlow and Jacob. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked my stream, you can hit that follow button and you'll see more stream casts from tournament games and Pro Mod. And please don't judge Flo based on the people that he had cast. We're just yeah. inappropriate. And I'd like to thank Colors and Zen Digital as my co casters. And thank for you guys. Ruining, he'd like to thank us for ruining any chance he has of casting any other games. <laughs> You're welcome. Let's hear, let's hear yeah. for Zen Digital and Colors, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! Go Woo! us! <laughs> Team Stick Up Kids War Cry, bitches! <laughs> Woo! Woo! And don't forget to check out WatchLeftForDead.com for the future uh, tournament streamcast. I believe Kiss Me is streaming a tournament game either right now or soon. So make sure to stay posted on that and have a good day or night, ladies and gentlemen. And in closing, for all you potential casters out there, this is a perfect example of why you should never ask me colors to cast. Ever. <laughs>